Hello everyone, this is Bess McCarty, founder and coach with the MLM Millionaire Club School for Network Marketers, making network marketing simple. Topic of this Facebook Live is how to overcome shyness, what you can do about that. And um, my background is I, well right now I am a generic coach for network marketers. I'm not in a company, but I was in one for years, full time. It helped me to raise my son as a single mom. Welcome, Kathy. How are you? Hi, David. Welcome. So glad you guys are here. Um, talking about how to overcome shyness. And by the way, if you are hearing, for people who are hearing this replay, I'd love if you type replay in the comments so I can thank you for watching. And if anyone has ever been shy in their life and can relate to this, I'd love if you type yes. <laughs> and maybe, uh, you know, I won't feel so alone here. <laughs> that uh, this is maybe not an uncommon uh, challenge that a lot of people face. Hello, Andrew. How are you? So good to see you. Sending you love. So um, I am now a generic network marketer, but I started out when I was 23 in network marketing uh, with a nutrition business. And I was on a mission to save the world with better nutrition and help people get healthy. The only problem, I was very, very shy. Hi, David. Glad to see you. Um, so glad. Thank you for your hello. So I was so shy that as a kid, I would hide in my room when company would come over uh, because I just wanted to be invisible. Even in a group of people, I would, I would just um, uh, want to disappear. Thank you for the likes and loves, everybody. Appreciate that. <laughs> Um, so ha have you ever felt that way? I was so shy um, because I I didn't think that I was going to be liked or approved of. Uh, maybe I would be criticized. Uh, maybe I wasn't as good. I felt like I wasn't as good as other people. I didn't belong. So I would keep to myself. And I was lonely, but I was safe from all that stuff. You know, that, that criticism, that disapproval, the, 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 the fear of not being liked and all that. Hello, Shania. Welcome. If, in, can anybody relate to this? Uh, I'd like if, if, you, if you want to, to, to type yes in the, the comments um, so that people, and so I won't know I'm so alone, so that others won't know they're alone either. So... Um, I figured, well, how am I going to do my mission to do my network marketing business and help people to get healthier with it? Well, I had to get past all that stuff. I had to overcome that. And I've heard that, a new, you know, if you want to reach your next level, it's going to require a new you. It's going to require a different version of you. And so I learned to do all that stuff. I learned to, to talk to people and overcome all that stuff that was holding me back. Hello, Julio. Welcome. So I ended up going door to door and I taught classes and became a trainer and a teacher and spoke on stage and I won awards and my favorite was a trip to the Bahamas. <laughs> I loved that and with people that I knew and loved and worked with. It was real fun working with people and coaching and bringing them on the team and all that. So, um, I can say that, uh, thank you for the likes and loves, everybody. Uh, and again, if you're watching the replay, I love you type replay in the comments so I can thank you for that. And if you share this with someone that you know that is fighting shyness, trying to overcome shyness, that this is a challenge for them, uh, please share. And if you do share, please type share so that I can thank you for that. And thank you for thinking of them. So I did overcome my shyness, and I'll give you a few tips in a minute. Um, right now, I am just having a ball. I am in my element. I love and I love to teach and train and work with people and speak, and I'm just having a thrilling life and a very fulfilling life. And I wouldn't have had this if I wouldn't be having this now if I had not figured out how to overcome my shyness. So I would like to share that with you. These are a few tips. This is how I did this. And this started when I was a teenager. I read Seventeen magazine, and it said that if you 
are shy around a boy, like you're at a dance or something like that, and you're shy around him, to start asking him questions about himself. And that gets the attention off of you, your attention off you and onto him. And isn't that what shyness is? It's simply um, putting attention on ourselves. And so when we shift that to the other person, we can no longer be shy. And I realized, oh my goodness, shyness is a selfish thing. There's no, nothing wrong with putting attention on ourselves. But if we want to turn that around, we can put the attention on the other person, ask them about themselves. What are their um, hopes and dreams? What are they aiming for in life? What do they like to do? You know, become curious and interested in them. That's the same thing we know in sales, isn't it? That you ask quite interested questions in the other person. So I thought, okay, that gets the attention off me. And I realized how selfish that I was to be shy. You know, it's all about me, all about me. So I make it all about the other person and my shyness disappears. For me, having an attitude of service. Uh, I'm, I'm very active uh, in my spirituality, my personal spirituality and my spiritual path. And that is all about service. And I found that when I focus on service, I am not shy. I am, again, probably the reason because I'm thinking of the other person. So it makes a lot of sense, right? It's just logical. Um, I'm thinking about, well, what do they need and how can I help them along in their life? How can I make life a little better for the next person, for this person I'm talking with? And that just eliminates my shyness. All of a sudden, I have a reason, a reason to help them. And people like that, actually, when, <clears throat> when your attention's on them, when you're curious about them, they like talking about themselves. And so, therefore, they're not busy criticizing me um, because I'm really there for them. And that has overcome my shyness. Um, welcome, Tore. Welcome, everybody. Uh, if anyone can relate to shyness, uh, type yes. If you are committed to overcoming shyness, please type yes. And if you have any tips, this is really, the, my Facebook Lives are not just for a one-way discussion here. They are for a two-way. So if you have any thoughts, tips, responses to this or questions about shyness, how to overcome it, or anything about your network marketing business, I'd love if you type that in the comments and we can bring that into the discussion. I can share your wisdom with the group and answer questions, which of course benefits everyone. Every question you have is not unique. Everybody often wants to know that too. So feel free to type in the questions while I um, share with you a few more tips. Another thing that always helps to overcome shyness is learning the skills of network marketing. Because when you get the skills, guess what? Confidence comes with it. And the seven skills um, that I teach in my School for Network Marketers, the MLM Millionaire Club, are the seven ones that Eric Worre identifies in his book, Go Pro, Seven Steps to Becoming a Network Marketing Professional. And that is finding people to talk to, inviting them, presenting, including telling your story, and following up, including handling objections, and then signing them up, and then getting them started right so they have success very fast, right off the bat, and you don't lose them. And then lastly, getting people to events, local and company, convention and generic events, because that's, that's the most money-making skill of all. So I help people to do this. We start with where to find people to talk to and what do you say to them. The two places that most network marketers, perhaps you, are stuck and the place where if you sponsor somebody, those are the first two questions they always have. Who do I talk to and what do I say? So I have found a way, I've discovered a way to make this very, very, very simple. And the easiest way that I can present all of this all of these tips on how to get over shyness is with my Always Get a Yes free workshop that you can attend or that you can even hold for your team. And this, the, there's tips in here that work across the board with all four personalities, even with friends and family that have already told you no there's a way, a question you can ask to approach them to where they will hear what you are, are doing. 
So you can go back to all the people that you've already gone through, your friends and family, and use this method. It's real simple. It always works. It always gets a yes. It's instant. It's duplicatable. It works in every circumstance. What other script or technique do you know that does all this? So this is what I teach in my Always Get a Yes free workshop and book. And if you would like this, I'll put this, I'll put this in the, I'll put, actually just um, private message me because I would like to get this to you personally if you would like this. And if anyone has comments, please type them in. Maybe you have a tip of how to overcome shyness or you have some feedback about what I'm saying today or you have a question about shyness or about anything with your network marketing business. These Tuesday Facebook Lives that I do, 2 p.m. Central Time every Tuesday, are for you to come on and ask any question you want of a network marketing coach. So feel free to type in a question, comment, or insight that I can share with the group. And meanwhile, I'm going to um, just tell you a, a little bit about this workshop and about my book that um, is also included. Or, 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 yeah, the information in the book is there too. So one of the, I just did this workshop um, Sunday for a wonderful group of people and the feedback was so happy. <laughs> they just loved it. And I am watching them go off and use this in their business to explode their business. And the feedback I've gotten, it has been, honestly, after a free workshop, honestly, I was at a loss to know what to do. I really appreciated what this did for my team just on the based on the results from today. And also very helpful. My team loved it. So uh, um, I think your team will love you for providing this workshop for them. But if you just want to check it out yourself, let me know that too. And just private message me here on Facebook and I'll get that information to you. So does anyone have a comment, question, uh, again, if you're watching the replay, please type replay so I can thank you. If you're sharing this with people that you know that are struggling with shyness, you know, that's probably a lot of people. Um, I would love it if you share this with them because I'd like to help as many people as possible. And please write share so that I can thank you for that. Um, if you would like to, if you have ever felt shy in your life, I'd love if you type yes or describe you know what your challenge was or is and and if you overcame that how you did that so I could share that with people so I'll wait just a moment for those comments uh, to come in because I don't want this just to be one way um, meanwhile thank you for being here thank you Femi thank you Tore Julio everybody who's joined I really appreciate you for joining in um, hope this helps your team um, I like to help people overcome blocks. Maybe that's why I'm called the shrink of MLM. <laughs> I like that a lot. Um, <laughs> funny, but really that's the most unique thing that I bring to the table is the therapy background that I have for 30 years. So fortunately I can combine that with the coaching in network marketing. And not many network marketing coaches have that therapy background. So that is the most unique thing that I bring. It's very, very handy because a lot of blocks are inside of us, aren't they? Besides, we get the skills, and if we still aren't doing our work, you know, what's the, the challenge? A lot of those are mindset blocks, like I had when I was shy. So um, I worked out to overcome that, but it can happen quickly for you, if you wish. Be glad to help with that. So um, if I can, if you have any of these challenges and would like assistance, that's what I'm here for. Just private message me. And welcome, Liesl. Glad to see you. Thank you for the likes and loves, everybody. I'm going to go ahead and conclude now. If you're just joining us, uh, be assured you can watch. Hello, Liza. She says, hi, Riz. Thank you. Be assured you can watch the replay in just a few minutes. And I think there's some cool tips in there for you to help yourself and help your team when they run into shyness, too. And, of course, they do. <laughs> okay. Thanks, everybody. Take care. Let's change the world. Let's let people know what you have because... There's people out there who really, really need it. This is the best chance for a better life that I know anywhere. That's why I'm a coach for network marketers. So let's help people to have that better life, whether it's moms who want to be home with their kids, people who want to escape the corporate grind, seniors who want a better retirement, students with loans to pay off. 
These people need to hear from you, okay? So um, I have these really, really great tips how to do this easiest for on you, easiest on you, and build your team the quickest so you can have recruits who are going out multiplying your efforts, not just you. So um, Liza says, will do. Thanks for all the value you add. That's what I get up for. That's what I love doing. Thank you for being here. Let's take this and go out and, and give it to the world. Okay, everybody, you take care. I'll see you later. I'll put the replay on now. Bye-bye.